Former Massachusetts Governor Mitt Romney made it official, or semi-official, on Monday when he announced he's forming an exploratory committee in anticipation of running for the Republican presidential nomination. That's about as official as it gets these days. Candidates have been very slow to officially announce their running, but the exploratory committee is considered to be tantamount to the announcement that Romney is actually going to be a candidate. Good time to look at where he stands in our Gallup tracking data based on Republicans across the country. As far as name ID is concerned, Romney certainly does all right. Uh, based on the last two weeks of interviewing, that would be through Sunday of this past week. Romney has an 83% name ID among Republicans. That puts him essentially tied with Newt Gingrich and Mike Huckabee, but below Sarah Palin, whose name ID is up there at 95%. So Romney certainly has high name ID, and that's one of the reasons that we find Romney doing well when you see those traditional trial heat polls asking Republicans, who would you vote for? But we have another way of looking at this, and that's our Gallup positive intensity score, which looks at how intensely Republicans feel about the candidates, and we only look at the Republicans who recognize the candidates. And here, Romney doesn't do all that well. The clear front runner is former Arkansas Governor Mike Huckabee, who has a positive intensity score of 27. He's been at the top all year long that we've been tracking this, and clearly above anybody else at this point. The person who comes in second is not Romney, but Minnesota Congresswoman Michelle Bachman, who has a positive intensity score of 20. She's not all that well known, but she does create intense support among those Republicans who know her. Now, below Bachman, here we come with Mitt Romney at 17, essentially tied with Sarah Palin and with Herman Cain, another less well-known potential Republican candidate. Below them are Newt Gingrich, who comes in at 15, and Tim Pawlenty, the former governor of Minnesota, who also has a 15 positive intensity score. Bottom line on this, Romney certainly has name ID. That's not his problem. But right now, our Gallup tracking suggests he's just not attracting a lot of intense support from Republicans. And that's what he's going to need if he is going to, in fact, win the Republican nomination to face off against President Barack Obama next year. I'm Dr. Frank Newport, Gallup Senator-in-Chief.